Hi friends, I'm Megan, aka Megan It, and this is my baby Layla. Layla is a princess, and today we're gonna make her her very own princess bed. Right, Bubba? Let us begin. <laughs> Should I start like that? I shall take you on a voice of a journey as I shall. Here you'll see I'm eyeballing this little coffee table, which I cleared off to take a better look at. And as I was doing so, the clerk told me it was 50% off. No brainer, took that bad boy home for 20 bucks. Then I moved on to Goodwill, where I wanted to shop for a blanket. And there are lots of grandma blankets there, but I liked this one with the flowers on it because it's cute. Mm. Okay, so I made my last stops at Home Depot and Joanne's and got the last bit of materials I needed and then began the project. Let's see. As I was sanding, I realized I sanded over a word this general area here and I went to wipe off the particles of wood I had sanded into the engraved word and then wiped it off to see that it says Cushman so I googled Cushman coffee table turns out this is an antique made out of maple being sold on eBay for $250 and uh, Still gonna paint mine, but thought you should know. Pretty cool. Okay, I just finished my first layer of stain and it's living up to the color that it says it is, sun bleached. I'm just not sure I'm crazy about it. You guys tell me. Definitely bleached. I don't know. Just stopped at Home Depot again. Let's see what we got. Okay, so this is the antique white finish instead of the sun bleached one we got because that one turned out to be a little too gray. Then we got some polyurethane in satin finish so it's not too shiny and some sandpaper to get off the sun bleach one. Hello puppy. Okay I decided it's a bit too gray with the layer of sun bleach that we did. I'm gonna lightly sand the table again and go over it with antique white. We're gonna mark off the bottom portion of the legs here and that will be spray painted color of lilac. So beautiful. I'm not sure what type of math this is, but how the hell do you get a straight line across with tape on a crooked leg? Someone help send help. Fill for the pillow portion of the bed. 
Um, I, it's just so expensive and I don't understand it. I just, I don't understand it. So what I'm going to do is cut these disgusting pillows we have that our dog lays on now and see what I can salvage from the inside. Let's get to cutting. This is dangerous. Don't dance with scissors. We are in the midst of sewing. I've done one whole side so far. Uh, working my way towards the other end. And then I'm gonna put the zipper in. That's all. Update. I'm dead. I've never sewn a zipper before, but I feel like a genius right now. Cause I'm doing it. And I'm doing it right. <laughs> We're back home. Here's a frog. Oh, oh. He hates me. He hates me. Send help. Help. And I'm kind of freaking out. Take a look. <laughs> <laughs>